how nodes work. In a nutshell, you have the beginning, the starting point, and the ending point. The beginning here is called the media in. So this brings in your footage and the media out. This is what gets rendered to the timeline. And any fanciness that I do in Fusion is going to happen in between these two nodes. So if I want to make this clip brighter, I can grab a node like brightness and contrast and put it in between these two nodes and I can push that up and that's going to make my resulting image brighter. But it's only going to do that if I actually run this node flow through the nodes like this. If this isn't connected, it can be in the middle all day. I mean, it could just be it could be super in the middle. It could be it could be Malcolm in the middle. You were right. You can't beat the system, but you sure can break it. But because it's not connected, that means that it's not going to affect this image. It has to be connected. So how you connect nodes are you grab this little square and you click and drag and you drop it on whatever node you want to connect it to next. So I'll drop this onto brightness and contrast and then take the output of brightness and contrast and plug that into my media out. And there I have my brighter image and the flow by default goes from left to right. So this is step one, this is step two, and this is step three. So we're bringing in our footage, we're brightening it, and then we're putting it back on the timeline. I have this bright footage here. If I switch back over to my edit page, then it is in fact bright. I have a free course right here on YouTube that'll teach you everything you need to know about visual effects in Fusion. Click right there.